Hey, welcome to the Subway Post Game Show here where the Houston Texans defeat the New Orleans Saints 23-10. I'm alongside CBS Sports' Charlie Cassley. I'm NFL.com's Pat Kerwin. Charlie, great game in your old football team, Houston Texans. Pretty darn good today. Yeah, impressive win for them. It, it starts with the fact that for the for only the third time this year, they had Matt Schaub and Andre Johnson on the field together. Andre Johnson is the most valuable player. He's a Pro Bowl receiver. What's he do today? He gets a 70-yard touchdown catch. So you put those two guys in the field. This is an offense that can move the ball. Ron Dane, good ball possession today. Good physical runner. Helped him protect the lead in the fourth quarter. Mario Williams came up big today with six tackles, a sack and a forced fumble. Good win for the Texans. It was a terrific win for the Texans. And I looked at the Saints real close here, and I think the problem that was going to happen when they lost Deuce McAllister is still there, and it's probably going to get worse because I think Reggie Bush cannot handle the power running load inside to go along with the wide receiver stuff that he has to do in the spread sets. Only 47 yards rushing today for the New Orleans Saints. Too much pressure on the passing game. They still like to spread you out, and I thought there were some opportunities early, but three turnovers was the story for the New Orleans Saints today and a great day for the Houston Texans. It was. Ed Houston goes to 5-5, five and, five and, 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 and a little momentum right now. The bye got him a little bit healthy. The momentum gets him going here. Key there, Andre Johnson. Andre Johnson, if he can stay on the field for the last six games a year, gives them a chance to play with any of the teams left on the schedule because it gives them the home run threat they have. And for the Saints, they're going to have to deal with the reality that the Tampa Bay Bucks got a win today and they're pulling away in the division. There's really no margin of error left right now for the New Orleans Saints, and they've got a tough road to go. Hey, thanks for watching the Subway Post Game Show. You can check out all our video across the CBS Audience Network. For Charlie Cassidy, I'm Pat Kerwin. Take care.